Modern Horizons 3. Fantastic set. We're giving away the top hit. Gotta say that in the first few seconds. It's funny, I've been looking at my analytics recently, and 40% of viewers stop watching the video in the first 30 seconds. So I have to say we're doing a giveaway right at the beginning, or else most people don't even realize I do giveaways. All right, so let's get right into these. The way you enter the giveaway, by the way, is simply comment below, and about five or six days after the video goes live, I use an online random lens. I use a random YouTube comment picker, and it chooses one of the comments at random, and that is the winner. So all you have to do is comment. All right, Swamp, here we've got Old Border, Commons and Uncommons, Lion Umbra. Now the good stuff, Devourer of Destiny, Trench Post for Commander, Nadu, not bad, not bad. It is a rare, Kappa Cannoneer, that one's a couple bucks. It's an Old Border, that's interesting. Oh, wow, first pack. Look at that. Fantastic, not textured. But very cool. Foil Solitude from the Special Guests. That's a great card. That could be a contender for the best hit. I know the whole Elemental Cycle has fallen in value quite a bit. Actually, I'm going to just lay it down right there. Of course, those get sleeved up after the video, but there's a lot of glare on the sleeves, so I don't sleeve them during the video. My Wither and Bloom... Creation of Addison, Stump Stomp, all right, the Foil Land, we've got Monstrous Vortex, Unholy Heat, Echoes of Eternity for the regular border, Eldrazi Confluence, Polluted Delta, very nice, that is a Fetch Land, we've got, oh, that was a double Fetch Land pack, right, yeah, search your library, yep, double Fetch Land pack, we had a Extended and a borderless. And then we've got Springheart Nantuko. All right, double fetch land pack. That's pretty cool. I think my first box had four fetch lands total and three of the, uh, what are they called? Gems. Medallions, that's what they are. Uh, Hard Evidence and Skoa. We've got Mythic Rao. Not bad at all. Salvation Colossus. Monumental Henge, that's the other land cycle. Ooh, nice! Old Border Esper Sentinel. They're Old Border Modern Horizons 2. Oh, look at that, double! That's really cool. Double Esper Sentinel. That was really cool. Just rare, but that has some good value there. Especially the foil. The old border foil is probably pretty good. In fact, I'm going to put that up here, even though it's not a mythic. The old border foil is really cool. You can see it in frame right there a little bit. All right, this is a mythic, so that'll go up there. All right, moving along. Meltdown, Disciple of Freilis. We've got Old Border Uncommons, Charitable Levy. Now Roshin, Aggressive Biomancy. Harrogast, very nice. The portrait borderless style. That is a mythic. Warren Soul Trader. Not a bad card in Borderless. Windswept Heath, there we go. That is our third fetch land of the box. And we still have plenty of box to go. No medallions yet. All right, Nyxborn Hydra, Wing It, Emrakul's Messenger. We've got Old Board. Oh no, we've got a snow covered waste instead of an Old Border. That's interesting. And then Null Elemental Blast. Disruptor Flute. Rare. Barrow Goyf. Interesting. 
We've got Windswept Heath again. Second Windswept Heath. This one's non-foil, so that brings us to four fetch lands now. Flare of Duplication. Flare of Cultivation. Foil Borderless. And that's a, uh, a break, right? Like, uh, I forget what they call it, but it's like the artwork is coming over the text boxes. I forget what they decided to call those. Was it a border break? All right, sixth pack of the box. Metastatic, Warm Power Stone. All right, here's the plane. So we've got a couple uncommons there. Orange Chant, not bad. Followed by Hourglass of the Lost for Commander. That's a cool artwork. That's cool. Put that as a painting on your wall. Jet Medallion, Borderless, very nice. Our first medallion. Oh yeah, we got the Doggo. Very nice. Borderless Portrait Doggo. Very nice. Oh, wow. Brea, Ethereum Shaper, Etched Foil Mythic. Very nice. Etched Foils are a little bit rarer. You only get like a couple per box now instead of one per pack like they did in, uh, what, like 2x2 two two and maybe even Commander Masters. Well, Commander Masters, one per pack. So the Etched Foils are a little bit rarer now. Right, Aether Spike and Brain Surge foil. We have Bloodstained Mire, very nice. Yet another fetch land. I'm gonna keep track of the fetch lands. I'll pull them all out at the end. All right, Gluttonous Hellkite. Got Layla, not a bad card at all. Especially in Border. It's Endurance. There we go. Old Border Reprint Endurance. We have a Solitude and an Endurance in this box. Got two of the Elementals. All right, Weight of the Reliquary. That's cool. Double Elemental box. Maybe that'll be the title of the video. And Solitude and Endurance are the two good ones, right? Because Fury's banned, so it lost a lot of value. So I think Solitude and... Endurance are the best, too. All right. On to Nesting Grounds. And, oh, is that a Modern Horizons 1 reprint? Interesting. I didn't realize they had those in here. Monumental Henge. We've got Jyoti. The Commander Mythic. Put that one over there. I guess you can't really see that. But it's up there. All right, Ripples of Undeath. Another Bloodstained Mire. This one in Old Border. We're getting way more fetch lands than this. Oh! Oh, this is texture, isn't it? Because it's got, like, the super cool... Oh, it is! Wow! Okay, well, I guess this is probably going to be the giveaway now. Holy cow. Tamio, Seasoned Scholar. That is a beautiful card. They got, like, the double foiling on these. That is... Very good looking. Very nice. Put that one like that. Probably going to be the giveaway winner. Unless for some reason the texture drops suddenly in value. But, uh, yes. We'll recap the best hits at the end. You can tell me which one you think is the best hit of the box. All right, we've got Old Border Snow-Covered Waste. And Victimize. Now, Pearl Medallion, very nice. Regular Border Foil. Inversion Behemoth for Commander. Kudo, the Borderless Portrait. And Toxic Deluge, very nice, rare. Oh, Pearl Medallion. Foil Borderless. Border Break, even, or Text Break, whatever it's called. Right, a little bit faster through the commons and uncommons. We've got Charitable Levy, Old Border, Metastatic Evangel, 
and aether spike. Uh, invert polarity. Selective obliteration. Cool. Disruptor flute and extended. Emerald medallion. We're getting more medallions and more fetch lands in this box than the first one. I thought the first box was super good too. Kappa cannoneer. I guess the first box did have three Ugin's Labyrinth, so. <laughs> guess I can't really complain about that box. It's just this box has way more medallions and fetch lands in it. All right, Void Pouncer, Siege Smash, Fell the Profane, Old Border, Accursed Marauder, and Consuming Corruption. Now the goods. Emrakul! Look at that. Very nice. Okay, now I think this actually might be the top hit of the set. So maybe I get to keep this Tamiyo that is super cool looking. <laughs> Emrakul, very nice. Wow, these boxes are pretty darn crazy. This is so much value. I see why they were trying to initially sell these for like 500 bucks or something ridiculous like that. Strix Serenade, Foil, or uh, Borderless. Flare of Cultivation, rare. Ooh, we got an etched foil philia. I might keep this one in my collection as well. Very cool. I don't know, it depends. Usually what I'll do is, uh, right when the set releases is when they're, you know, the most expensive. So I sell them, and then I wait six months, and they drop, you know, 60% in price, and then I buy them again. That's what I will usually do. All right, Island. And Evolution Witness, Dragon's Rage Channeler, ooh, Modern Horizons 2. And Flare of Cultivation. Jyoti, we got another one. This one in non-foil. White of the Reliquary. Psychic Frog, cool. That's a interesting looking artwork there in the borderless. Right, Disruptor Flute, Foil. That was the last pack. So, I'm pretty sure that Emrakul is the top hit. Let me just check TCG Player real quick. All right, so the Emrakul Regular Border Foil, I think, currently, is actually less. That Tamiyo is more, I'm pretty sure. Not sure how long that's going to stay like that, but let me tell you, I'm just going to make the executive decision because I think this card is absolutely gorgeous that uh, this is going to be our giveaway. The double rainbow textured back Tamiyo. This is a fantastic card. Amazing looking. All right, so make sure to comment down below if you want this card. And I have five more collector booster boxes to open. And so make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.